Durham, North Carolina is a place which the world instinctively associates with tobacco. It has, however, other claims to notice. Today, there is a singular group in Durham where a black man may get up in the morning from a mattress made by black men in a house which a black man built out of lumber which black men cut and planed. He may put on a suit which he bought at a colored haberdashery and socks knit at a colored mill. He may cook victuals from a colored grocery store on a stove which black men fashioned. He may earn his living working for colored men, be sick in a colored hospital, and buried from a colored church. And the Negro Insurance Society will pay his widow enough to keep his children in a colored school. This is surely progress.